Two fox fairies, Susu and Juju, steal a powerful magic pearl to save their clan, which is guarded by Yen Qixiao, an experienced demon hunter. Fleeing from him, Susu absorbs the pearl and loses her memory. The girl wakes up in a small mountain village and does not remember who she is. She is taken care of by local boy Hianqing, who falls in love with Susu without realizing who she is. But the absorbed pearl not only gives Susu unprecedented power, it undermines her body and spirit, and if she doesn't get rid of it, she will soon die. If you don't know that the path of Chinese online cinema to its audience is often long and thorny, you might think that director Huang Yi is some kind of workaholic, because in the summer of 2023 three of his films were released in just one month. Moreover, all of them are not connected to each other and were created by different crews, so we're definitely not talking about some production optimization. As if this is not enough, they are also very different genres. On July 18th was released a folklore thriller, The Puppet, a month later, August 17th, exploitation thriller, Lamb Game, premiered, and between them sandwiched romantic fantasy, White Fox, which will be discussed now. Commercially, White Fox performed the worst of all of this trio, and very significantly, earning 15 times less than the Lamb Game. Indeed, of all three films, it feels the most old-fashioned, as if it was made years ago, in a completely different era of Chinese online cinema. Outdated special effects, formulaic plot with a minimum of twists and turns, sketchy characters, straightforward attempts to squeeze out a tear all this could play well in 2020, but now this kind of movie is mostly perplexing. What were they counting on? To be fair, it seems that the authors were well aware that the chances of their project to catch someone's interest in 2023 are not so high, so they honestly tried to make the viewing for those, who still fell for the film, as comfortable as possible. They provided the film with a colorful picture in an atypical for internet cinema aspect ratio of 185 to 1, in the vast majority of cases, online films are shot in 235 to 1, and carefully decanted from the story all the plot water to fit the viewing in a comfortable 68 minutes. The result is simple, naive, very derivative, but at least it's not boring. The lead role in White Fox is played by Chinese actress Keaton Jiang, and for people who follow Chinese show business, it's a sign that producers obviously didn't have high hopes for the movie. Jiang debuted back in the late noughties and was prophesied to have a great future, but in the late tens the actress found herself at the center of a scandal, ruining the popular star couple of Chen Xiang and Rachel Mao. Fans supported Mao and hated Jiang, so that the career of the latter immediately went down and now it can be seen only in the second echelon web series. And internet movies like White Fox, which are doomed to instant oblivion.